Welcome Aquarius. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Let's dive into it. Okay. Let's see what energy is coming towards you guys for the remainder of January. January 15th through the 31st for my Aquarius. What message is there for Aquarius? Ooh. Ooh. All right, so you guys seem like you are not in a good mood, okay? Is it due to someone being single, someone having to do something by themselves, you know, focused on the material aspect? Maybe you're not feeling too good about yourself materially. Okay, I, I see some truth getting ready to be revealed, okay? I see recognition and reward and wisdom. Okay. So for some of you guys, this could be something in regards to a situation at work. Okay. Maybe some type of truth comes out. Let's get some clarifiers. Let's see. Why is truth here? Why is truth here? Okay, the truth comes out about, about someone walking away. We got Sagittarius energy here, but the truth comes out about somebody walking away. Why is the Eight of Cups here? The Sun card, Leo. Okay, hmm. Ooh, somebody is definitely a player here. Okay, so recognition and reward. Okay, eight of wands, communication, good news is coming in. Good news is coming in. Okay, so it seems like good news is coming in. Why is, why is wisdom here? Why is wisdom here? Why is wisdom here? This is the Hierophant. You could be dealing with the Taurus. Okay. Justice. Libra's energy. Some of you could be studying, okay? Some of you could be studying something. Why is the Justice card here? Oh, okay. So there needs to be some type of resolution, okay? There needs to be some type of resolution, okay? Definitely trying to balance the situation out. Trying to do things by the book and trying to balance this situation out. I'm picking up that there was a strong bond here. But I feel like right now this could be going on. Okay. This could be going on. Yeah, the truth most definitely, if it hasn't came out, is getting ready to. Okay. This is about someone walking away, okay? Someone turning their back, someone, you know, acting like they don't care. Someone acting like they don't care, okay? That they aren't interested. You guys could just be feeling, you know, a little down, okay? You could be feeling alone. You could be feeling like you're left to do things by yourself. Give me a message for Aquarius, please. Please give me a general read for Aquarius for January 15th through the 31st. Thank you, God. What is that for Aquarius? Okay. Okay, we got Scorpio's energy here. We got... Knight of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. We got King of Pentacles. We got Taurus. Lots of people. Okay. Yeah, there's just lots of stuff going on. Okay. All right, let's see. 
I feel like with this tower card here, something happened out of the blue. Okay, something happened out of the blue. Why is the tower here? Something just happened. Okay, yeah, like the full card here. Something happened out of the blue, okay? Or something fell apart, okay? Something fell apart, okay, look. And then someone had to walk away. We got King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, this energy, Eight of Cups. Someone definitely, like, walked away or left something behind. Some Somebody left something behind. Why is the Knight of Wands here? The Knight of Wands, this energy is very flighty, very kind of, like, unreliable, type of energy someone that's always in and out six of cups okay something somebody did something again or something did something again or there was like a repeat okay there's some type of repeat something isn't working here something isn't working and you are pissed okay Something did is not working out. Something didn't work out. Why is the King of Pentacles here? We could be dealing with the Earth sign. Okay. Okay. Four of Swords. Okay. Maybe something that was valuable started to crumble. Because I feel like maybe you feel like you don't have the resources to fix this. Okay. Okay. Why is the Three of Cups here? There we go again. Four of Cups. You guys are... This is you guys' energy. Like, this came out three times. Okay? You feel like you don't have the support. Four of Cups and the Three of Cups. You feel like you don't have the support. Okay? Okay? Nobody's trying, like, not putting in any effort. Why is the Nine of Pentacles? Why is the Nine of Pentacles here? Nine of Pentacles, you feel like you got to do it by yourself. Okay, you got to be self-sufficient and get everything done. Okay, why is the Nine of Pentacles here? The Hermit card. So, you feeling like you got to do things, you know? You got to chuck it up and get it, okay? I feel like this is how you feel. You could be feeling like left out, you know? You could be feeling like, you know, whatever this is, it's something that happens just like out of the blue. And then it's like you don't feel like you have the support around you, okay? Why is the Hierophant? The Hierophant came out twice as well, too. Why is the Hierophant here? The Strength card, okay. Leo's energy, okay. Four of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups, okay. I feel like you could be holding back, okay. I feel like you're resistant. Why is the Strength card here? Oh, you be worried, okay? This this situation has you feeling like this, okay? Possibly aren't getting that, that good of sleep. Let's see what advice we can get for you. What advice is there for Aquarius, please? Give me some messages for Aquarius. 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 So the message we have for you is be gentle with yourself, okay? 
I, I do pick up that you guys are kind of really, really worried and stressing about something, okay? You've been through a lot and need some time to heal and recover, okay? So take that time, okay? Don't stress yourself out. Don't. Okay, have some self-confidence. Believe in yourself by believing in God working through you, okay? So please, guys, be gentle. Be gentle with yourselves during this time. Don't don't put too much wear and tear on your mind, your body. You know, keep your thoughts positive, okay? Keep your thoughts as positive as you can during this time, okay? All right, my loves. I hope this reading was helpful. And I just want to let you guys know that I am currently running a new client special, okay? So if you need any guidance or any uh, spiritual advice, I am running a special for $25, you can ask me a question. You'll get a five-card read, okay? And you'll get an additional question for free. But the second question has to be a yes or no question, okay? Because I'm going to utilize my pendulum for the second question, all right? All right, my loves. Until next time. Ciao for now.